Ginger Art Tip, I want to show you a trick to use uh, with taking masking, paper, masking tape off paper. So I've just finished painting this painting of some swallowtail butterflies and I've taped it down with some masking tape. This is fairly low tack masking tape, but even so, masking tape can sometimes tear the edge of your paper. So you've got to make sure that you don't let the paper tear into the painting. So what I recommend is two things. What you've got to do is, uh, if you've folded a little tab on the end of your tape, that makes life a lot easier. That's a rule that I've got for myself. I always leave a little folded tab. But the first rule is to draw it away from the centre of the painting. So you're pulling always away in a direction never pull across the painting because it can tear the paper right in but if you pull it away from the painting but the other thing is also to keep the tape really low down onto the table so if i keep this tape really low but i pull away from the painting it keeps this painting really safe even just in case the edge of this paper tears it's not going to cause any damage to the actual artwork so this is a really fun thing to do to take the tape off a painting. I love doing it. So it's great fun to have a look at the finished painting with the lovely white edges. So remember to pull the tape away from the painting and keep it low. Don't pull upwards because that can cause tears going back into your painting as well. So any little bits of paint coming in underneath the masking tape don't matter at all because if this is going to be framed then the matte board will cover all of that so I don't usually worry about that sort of thing. So pulling slowly, low and away from the painting causes no problem. So it looks so nice once you've got rid of that masking tape. You've got a lovely clean edge to your painting. So pull low and away from the painting and you end up getting a nice clean edge without damaging the painting. So there's your tip for today. Thanks for watching.